Good afternoon, boys and girls. Trust you well. Here's the deal. Long time ago, I said I wouldn't touch any content that has politics attached to it. Then last night happened. And you see my face, so you know this is a bit different. See, last night, the country, by murmurings, or probably by fact, I've heard murmurings unconfirmed, that lockdown has gone back to level two. <laughs> well, some funny things about that. One, we've been here before. A wise man once said that if you don't learn from history, you're bound to repeat it. As I said, we've been here before. Lockdown four. Alcohol banned. Curfews in place that we have to go back to it means that the first time we did it, it didn't really work. Another wise man once said, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing and expecting different results. The thing about wise men is they are from the past. Yeah, all the wise men of the world were in the past and in the present. I think a few people would agree with me that we encounter quite a few dumb shits. And more worryingly, those dumb shits are in positions of power. Now you might be also thinking, well, why are you filming this in portrait mode? Oh, YouTube Shorts. Who knows, I may redistribute clips of this in the form of a YouTube Shorts. So yeah, two minutes back in the same place we were in like a year ago, two weeks. What's more astonishing or dumbfounding is that this government thinks that it's gonna solve a few things. Yeah, well, yeah, they may be right. They're gonna, it's gonna solve a few things. The uh, infection rate of COVID is gonna drop for two weeks. Yeah, and then we go back to level 3, level 2, level 69, and then the COVID rate, infection rate goes up. I think, wow, how did this happen? Okay, we'll take our call away, we'll put you back in lockdown, and we go again. It's like a merry-go-round. And this video will continue to be a merry-go-round if it is extended anymore than this. Don't expect another video about politics. I'm not a fan of it, clearly. Even less so about the humans inside of it. Take that last statement the way you want. So, thank you for chilling. I'll leave you with one message. You find the connection. Well then, now, find another one. Ever since Word of Tony United Mill, Dwight York has been the biggest threat.